Okay, so I switched my laptop on this morning and it comes up with this problem down here which says 0% available on the battery plugged in and charging. Uh, you think to yourself, hmm, that's odd, it wasn't like that before. Uh, you leave it on charging for a while and it doesn't change basically and won't go beyond 0%. Uh, so you uh, basically wasted three hours of my life looking on the internet for various solutions and people recommending all kinds of software fixes and change driver settings and stop the battery manager and all that kind of rubbish. And lo and behold, none of it works, which is probably why you're all looking here. Um, so to save you the three hours of your life as well, I've got you knocked up this video. So let's go back down to this again here. You can see it says definitely 0%. Now if I unplug the uh, power lead, it's of course going to die. It says, there we go, it's got a few seconds and whoosh, there it goes. Um, so now I will show you what the actual problem is. Okay, so I've taken the battery out the back and I've set up a voltmeter and a couple of little probes here, uh, made out of paper clip. So if we poke these into the relevant holes, you can see there it's reading a total voltage across three cells. And of course, this is a three cell LiPo because uh, this isn't a lithium ion on the side there, 11.1 .1 volt, which is of course a three cell LiPo. Uh, this is the bad battery I just took out. And it says 0 0.05 volts, and that's across all three cells, which is pretty bad. In fact, it's terminal. And then over here, this is a good one, which is fully charged. And you can see it says 12, if I hold it still, of course, 12.38 uh, volts. And um, so that's a charged LiPo, or pretty much charged, just under 100%. And of course, a LiPo is one of these, and on a radio control type battery, there we go, you've got your, you can read the individual cells there, and each one should be 4.2 volts roughly charged. And so that's the cause of it. it uh, basically, the battery's knackered. Now, you might be wondering why the battery's knackered. And if you look at this carefully, see there's a slight bulge there where the label's coming up, and that tells you what happened. So... If you want to know what causes this, suddenly overnight, because my laptop was actually fine and the battery actually had about, I would say, a good four or five hours um, working time on it the day before. And then the following day, completely knackered. And what it was is that when you, if you slam the laptop lid, basically something prevented your laptop going into hibernate and it couldn't hibernate. So it literally destroyed the cells right down to zero volts, which is below there. Um, minimum value which I think is 3.6 or 3.8 volts somewhere around there discharged and with lipos once you go below that level um, you basically damage the cells they disintegrate into nothing and they start to puff up and whatnot there you can see it's gone a bit fat and that is the end of your battery so don't bother with all the software fixes and all that kind of stuff get a cheap two pound voltmeter measure the battery across the voltage if it's a below about 10 volts maybe across all three cells do anything, so just bin it and buy a new one for a tenner.